This is the conservation of momentum principle. Explain how the initial momentum of a person on a skateboard is equal to the final momentum after the person throws the ball to the left. So I drew a X and Y axis. Put the sum of the momentum in the initial is the sum of the momentum final. So at this point, the momentum of the human initial is zero. So that cancels out. Um, and the momentum of the ball initial is zero, so that cancels out. So um, that gives me the equation zero equals momentum of the human final plus uh, the momentum of the ball final. So if he throws the ball to the left, the ball has momentum going this way, and which pushes the human in the positive direction. So... Um, that is why the momentum of the ball final is less than zero because it's moving in a negative x direction and the momentum of the human is greater than zero because it's moving in the positive direction which equals the sum of the momentum initially and you can also um, see this in, in a real life um, scenario with a water hose before you um, turn on the water when it's at rest and the nozzle is facing down um, you know the the momentum is is um, is uh, equal well when you turn on the water the pressure from the water uh, pushing down is also conserved by the the momentum is conserved by the hose uh, lifting away from the surface. So that's just another um, other example on how to um, explain the conservation of momentum principle.